Yes! Yes! Eureka! I've done it! I've done it! You little piece of crap! I did it! But uh, what's going on here? Not off, right? Uh, no, its location is normal. Yeah. Oh, f <laughs> why is that happening? What is up with that? Why is it going upwards? Bling bling. Ugh. Freak. Shake. A picker. Okay. Here we go. Finally. Urf. Angry noises. There. Finally. Oh, okay. Okay. Now. Okay, let me get back to like what this hall is all about. Uh, or well, this specific room, really. Um, and that is, when the players enter this room, they're faced with these, these uh, pools of liquid. Now. The interesting thing is that four of them are actually completely okay. No, you can really it's a mechanical door, but you know. I just realized we need a uh, a few indents there as well. Uh, okay. Now that one I really like. Uh, I don't remember how it. Oh yeah, it's it's opened by uh, there are buttons hidden in this room. One in each of the four pools, actually. And if the players uh, press all four at once, then they will open this uh, hidden door. And they'll be led into a nice little room, which I think we'll design right now, actually. Uh, because why the heck not? Why the heck not? Uh, okay. okay. Do we have had any activity in the shed? No, we are completely empty. Cry. Okay. Let me just design this kind of, you know, boring way right now. It's supposed to be a slithering way, but... Uh, for now, I'm kind of, you know, not... Not in mood to do that. What is it? One, two, three, four, and this is the one where it's supposed to turn. Which means we'll be needing a corner piece. So, here we don't need a corner piece, but oh my gosh. Now that is a nice little room. Let's save here. Now here, there is a statue, which I will not even try to, you know, build. Because that would be the death of me. So, instead, uh, we're just going to... Now make ourselves another one of those neat little quick designs. And uh, what we'll do here is take Lucy, one of the lender's favorite little things. And we'll just give her like a quick... Oh god, uh, that is way too many. Can I... Can I lower Lucy's vertices? Like, is that an option when I make her? Uh, no, it doesn't seem like that. Oh, shoot. Um, simplify. I have no idea what I'm doing. Ha <laughs> ha I have no idea what I'm doing. I might be completely screwing myself over. Uh, simplify, simplify. I know there's a simplify function somewhere. Da -da 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 -da. Where is it? What? Sim. Nope. Okay, 
you know what? Um, I have extra mesh. Let's use something else. Let's let's use a diamond. Oh, this might be what we want to use for another thing, though. Okay, I know what we'll do. We'll put it like this. Now we'll flip it. 180. There we go. And this will be our representation of a statue. Statue. Large, large material, no, large statue material. There we go. We still haven't had anything going on in the chat. Large statue. Um, okay, because we also have a smaller statue at one place. Okay. Okay, and uh, pool... Lar large. Also, have I taken a copy? No. Okay. Uh, let's place that there. Oh my god, this is taking a bit and we have just done the first room and are you ready for this it's starting to get dark I can't see so flip on the lights flip the hair Let's continue okay let's see here uh, what do I want to do next I think I want to take the path towards the library which is a very neat little path uh, for which I will be needing some corner pieces. Oh, for freak's sake. And I'll need to turn that 90 degrees. I need to go into 5, orthographic mode. Oh my lord. 180. 90 degrees. Let me quickly show my Twitcher. Live modeling a D and D. Saying I'm right, and but I try. Okay, let's see. How long is this path now? There's one, two, three, four, five. Okay, five tiles, which includes that one. So one, two, three, five, and one, two, three, five, and then it turns and goes one, two, three, uh, is there a much better way? do this that I'm not thinking about. Ooh. Um, there might be, well, whatever, you know, we're having fun, we're having a good time, having a good time, shooting stuff into the sky like a fighter. No, 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 I do not know the lyrics, but I'll try anyway. I'm just having a good time, having a good time. I'm just enjoying myself. That's that's the most important thing for now. Okay. Uh, what's this small room behind a door? Passage this room is lined with blood, shards, spell casters, 
And that's when you're signed in the room is behind an unlocked door. The room count yeah. Okay, so it has a door. Which will place there like so. Okay, now how big is this room? It's four by three. Okay. Let's I do this. Uh <laughs> Wow. I'm not starting up right here. Um, uh, <laughs> what am I doing? How did I do this? What what am I? <laughs> what did I do before? Yeah, I just put them as walls, didn't I? Uh, okay, so like so, I want to do it then like this and like this. I just want to put that there and this is up with freaking five by three. What? What am I doing wrong here? <laughs> okay, let's do like that. There we go. Okay. Now I think it's adding up. And then we want it by three, so one here. And then and, and you know, there's a lot of things that is really nice to have, but eh, most important thing. Have a good time. Enjoy yourself. Live. Living is probably the most important. Yeah. I say that's the most important thing uh, to make sure you do. <laughs> Keep living. Uh, okay, so uh, three. And this one I know is behind a hidden door. Da da da. So we'll have to duplicate this thing da, 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 and place it here like so. Now as one, two, and then we lead into the third one, which now we're having some problems. Yay, problems! Don't we all love those? Uh, because this room is bigger than it can be, as it looks. Ooh, that's a bit unfortunate. Okay, okay, how are we gonna solve this? We're gonna be able to solve this by doing like this, and like this. Okay, okay, we're getting there. And we place that there, 90 degrees. What is going on here? Suddenly I'm just letting go of things. Don't like it. Really frustrating me. <laughs> Am I cursed or something? Okay, how long is this room? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six floor tiles before we get another wall. Two. Okay, let's just take these. So. And then like so. Really, that will actually be uh, another thing. Now, this room I really like, to be honest. This is probably my favorite room out of all the rooms. At least that I have had the pleasure of having the players find. Um, because this place holds a role-playing aspect that I just real like enjoy that size of, side of D&D. &D. It's the fact that you get into a role. You get to, you know, play out something. You're this character. And to me, that's probably the best part about Dungeons and Dragons. It's the role playing aspect, you know, it's storytelling. Um, and in this room, there's a Yuan T female that is kind of you know, locked up. Or whatever you would call it. 
uh, and her tongue has been cut. Now, as you can imagine, that she doesn't have the ability to speak because of this. And uh, what my players did in this scenario, like faced with this problem, they solved it uh, after a bit of, you know, players will be players, they will, uh, someone will always want to kill them or threaten them with their life. Um, but in this scenario, that won't help. It won't help that they uh, threaten them at freaking knife point. Ain't gonna help you, Rogue. Um, so the fun thing is that the cleric of the party used the command spell. And basically, he commanded this Yuan-Ti to speak. At which point, they tried, but couldn't, because, you know, their tongue is not there. And, uh, but, you know, showing to the players that she has no tongue. And then the Barbarian, uh, you know, being out of character for a Barbarian, maybe, but she's, she's a known Barbarian, so whatever. Uh, figure out that they could use paper. And, you know, let her write something. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Ooh, that's a huge room. So that's... Um... But yeah, uh, so they talked to her. And basically, she is chained up by her legs to a pole that's running below the uh, whole thing. So I'm going to actually you know, show you that aspect. Uh, minus like so. This thing is taking up way too much space. Um, I can do a quick montage. Uh, this is looking really good. Uh, save. Let's go first. Okay, so... Basically, how this imprisonment thing works is, uh, let's move that up, let's move this towards us, so we can see what's going on here. Uh, okay, that's good enough for me. So, you got your floor, right? And then you got a sinking into the floor. In the sinking, there has been placed a rod going across. Let me just shrink that. And basically what's going on here is she has a chain going around here and hooking to each of her ankles, meaning she can't move out of that place. Locking her in place because of a crime she did, which was that she locked up people of a higher cost. And those who know you want to will probably know this, that they have a caste system. Uh, I don't remember if it's like Hinduism that has have a have had at least a caste system. Uh, I can't swear on that. My religion knowledge has faded a bit. Uh, but yeah, so you have this kind of thing going on where she's locked. She can't talk. Uh, but if someone tries to open the door, which is barred but bar. Blah, 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 Language, I, I write for a provision, uh, which is sealed up to this library, which is here. She will smirk at them, uh, which should, you know, give them a hint. But she won't attack them. She has not no weapons or anything. Uh, she's just there. Um, yeah. But she have locked up, like, I think it's 20 abominations in here. So if the players went in there, they would either, you know, make a lot of noise, attract all the freaking UNT, and yeah, you know, they'll they'll be slaughtered straight up. I can't see them winning up against twenty abominations. And like I'm the nice DM here. I'm the guy who, you know, tries to make them survive most of the time. Um But no. If they're careful, you know, sneaky, then they might actually have a stealth section go on and, uh, you know, try and hide. Now, here's going to be a challenge, and we're going to do this.
Hmm. This is gonna be interesting. Uh. Let's see how we do this. Okay, so we got. We got one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then it opens up into a broader tunnel. One, two, and then we enter a three by how much? Three by four. Uh, four. Uh, room. Thank goodness, I just realized I built this thing so that uh, there would be room between the places in the walls for UNT to sneak around. I just realized that's that might save me <laughs> uh, Okay, let's make a solid Solid wall today. Okay, let's remove doubles Let's dissolve edges. Oh wait, shit! I'm doing this to original, the OG freaking. I need a new tile, which is solid, solid wall tile, and it will also need a material. Salt. Did wall tile material. There we go. And now we can make this thing happen. Remove doubles, select, solve edges. There we go. Okay. Now with this thing, we'll be able to move it over here. And here's basically where we'll be needing it. Uh, like so, and so, and so. Okay, that's. And so, and so. And damn it! Five, there we go. Place it. Trucker. Okay. Um. I think I've got this. Oh. For. F I just want the goddamn door! How hard can it be to pick a freaking item? You know, just, just grab it. Ah! Uh, there's one, two, three. This one. One, two, tres. Tres. Quatro, cinco, seis, siete. Okay, uh, see, here. Boom, boom, boom. Ugh. God, stop double click and stop doing that too, please. This is starting to get really freaking annoying. Can I uh, go into any good solid? Okay, there we go. Yes, this is way more convenient. I should have been doing this from the start, but I didn't because I'm an idiot. <laughs> oh, aren't we having a good time? Zero people watching. Uh, uh, uh. Great. <laughs> there we go. Demoralizing myself again. Um, let's see. Let's place up there. Oh, let's move that thing there. I'm not streaming because I want certification. I'm streaming because I like to put myself out there. In case anyone finds it fun to watch this idiot blabber about. One, two, three, four.
four, four, no, tiles, one, two, three, four, and that, and 180, wow, we're starting to get late, I don't know how long I've been streaming for at this point, um, wow, we've been live for more than an hour already, time flies, Okay, let's move these like so, and let's 180 them. Okay, there we go. And um, this room, it's gonna be fun, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, we haven't even gotten to the fact that there's circular rooms and all this. Jesus. Uh, let me see if I. Da, 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 da. Yoda version mean it thing that doesn't budge. <laughs> oh god, this is great. Mean a thing it does not if that swing it ain't got. <laughs> wow, that's great. That's freaking great. This is amazing. Uh Uh, I can't see it. There we go. That is pretty great. Um, I mean, I think it does not. If that swing it ain't got. Hmm. Let's put it here. Because I. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I am lonely. We have no one in chat, which means it's just, it's just empty. It's just at here in this Discord chat. It's very. Very desolate. It's a bit boring. Okay. Uh, looks like we're making this room like this then. Uh, so, oh, for stop that stupid tiles. What have I ever done to you? I created you. Why must you betray me? Evil. Evil, evil things. Ninety minus. There we go. There we go. That is not good whistling. <laughs> Ah, fly me to the moon, and let me sing on the stars. Let me see what life is like on. Okay, we need another drawer. Jupiter and Mars. In other words, oh my hand. Darling, kiss me. Fill my heart with song and let me sing forevermore. Or will actually. Uh, this is a very special door, but I think we're just gonna. We're gonna symbolize it in another way that it's special. Fly me to the moon. And let me sing. No, you could do that. Fly me to the moon and let me play among the stars. Let me see what life is like on Jupiter and Mars. In other words, oh my. 
the world. Darling, kiss me. Fill my heart with song and let me sing forever. You are all I wanted, all I worship and adore. In other words, please be true. In other words, I love you. We have one person watching, and they're not saying anything. Let's see if we can spark some life into this chat so it's not very dead. Watch it now be that it's actually Tim is watching. That would like be the ultimate troll move. Fly me to the moon and let me play among the stars. Let me see what life is like on Jupiter and Mars. In other words, oh my heart. In other words. Darling, kiss me. Fill my heart with song and let me sing forever. You are all I wanted, all I worship and adore. In other words, please be true. In other words, I love you. Fly me to the moon and let me sing among the stars. Let me see what life is like on Jupiter. In other words, hold my hand. In other words, darling, kiss me. Fill my heart with song and let me. Hey, purple! We got a purple! I don't know how much lag we got. Oh, for frick's sake. Is my mouse giving up on me completely now? I think the mouse is completely giving up. Oh god. Mouse is dying. Shit. Shite. Okay, I'll be back. I need a mouse fix. God damn it.
Okay, hopefully these batteries will work. Okay, they don't. Shit. Okay, this is a bit unfortunate. Feeling these should be more fortunate. They feel a bit more weighty. Okay, they definitely have a bit of battery of energy in them. Yes! Haha! <laughs> it's low. Low battery, but we got working mouse. Haha! -ha. I am victorious! Against all odds, but I am victorious. Uh, okay. Let's place that there. Let's rotate it. Degrees, and this room also has a false wall. Um, I don't know. Let me actually think now if my players... No, my players haven't gotten here yet. They're in that room. Uh, they haven't reached this place yet. But they probably will next session, which is in two weeks. Sorry, I leave soon, but I want to play. Uh. Okay. We don't want to keep anyone busy. I am busy, and I said, "Oh, ho, ho, ho." Yeah, that was a real, really bad pun. Uh, okay. Um, so let's see here, we'll get that, and so, and, damn it, um, okay, well, oof, this is unfortunate, um, haha, <laughs> 90, no, 180, gotta rotate it 180. Um, let's see, this is one, two, three, and then it takes one turn, leading into a five by three room. So let's assign that room. Hey, it works. Oh, we got two people watching. So we got four more people. Uh, I don't know how far behind we're lagging. Let me check. Oh god. Oh, okay, wait. <laughs> okay, good. Uh, there's a lapsed time. Uh, live. I don't know if elapsed time means like how much lag we got. Oh, we're back to zero people watching. Okay. Um, if so, this is really freaking bad. Because it says like 45 minutes. Oh, I've actually been streaming for one hour. We might go for like a two hour stream and then I'll stop. Um, I think that's what I'm going for right now. Uh, textured. Gotta grab a few of the solid blocks. Okay, there we go, and... Now, okay, yeah, uh, I think this is a room where there's a scroll that will... that holds a spell that will weaken any UNT. Um, but particularly, it will weaken a... Um, the anathema, the huge boss of this place. So 
there. Uh, in this room, you got researcher peoples. Uh, we're actually moving, blasting through this. Holy shit. That's, that's a lot of map, actually. That's a lot of map. Um, now we got a 3x3 three three room. Okay, yeah, we can, uh, we can go for that design then. 90, like so. Okay, and we'll place that there. Duplicate that a few... For frick's sake, stop with the freaking double clicking. Now here we also got a statue. But this one is significantly smaller. So we'll actually have to 0.5 this thing down. Small statue. I'll actually move that over there. As well as the original small statue. There we go. Okay. Um, for frick's sake, uh, let's go into texture mode. What am I doing? I keep clicking Z, which takes me out of texture mode. Uh, for frick's sake, cat. Okay, um, here we want, is it a door? We're in room 12. Room 12, room 12. Room 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 4, and there, 12. Uh, stage of pit monster guarded by a bro guard that have a key on it. In a prison door. So, uh, their neck that had the key around. This room. Also statue that have a key around their neck. At the top of the room is a prison door that is locked. Okay, good. There we'll be needing the prison door tile. Yay! How cheerful. Okay, there we go. And of course it does that. Because we have not had any luck with this. Um, we haven't had enough bad luck with freaking positioning these things yet. So why not a bit more? Um, okay, we want to move these up and then rotate them 180. And then take a floor tile and we want to put that there. And this room is gonna be, oof, it's gonna be a mess. Um, Mmm, this is a very tight room. One eighty, one eighty. Because here we got a bunch of prisoners. Well, we got two prisoners, really. So I think we're actually going to have to develop a new kind of thing. Why am I using that tile? Should be using this tile. Okay, there we go. And, um. Okay, uh. But, da 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 da. Okay, now we'll be needing a few prison bar tiles. Yes, they are coming into play. Okay, uh, we've got a prison bars. Okay, we need a prison bar and a uh, normal tile combo here. So let's take this. Let's split it up. Let's actually just put it in here. And... Whoa, that's 211? Jeez. That's a lot. Should we uh, 
Womp. Tile. Wall. Tile. Point two eleven. There we go. And we want difference. Stay. Union. Apply that. What is the difference, really? So let's just select like this. And phases. Oh god, what have I done? What is this madness? Rare disease. This is madness. Absolute utter madness that I'm doing right now. Okay, join. There we go. Press on bar into wall tile. Press on bar into wall tile. Oh god. That is utter pain. There we go. Okay, okay, there we go. Now we'll be also needing a door here. Um, I just realized I deleted the freaking wall despite needing it right again. Um, oh, this is gonna present a problem. Um, let's just make a makeshift solution to this, really. Because I can't be bothered, so I'll just cheat the system a bit. And then we also need these. Which I'll do like this, and then I'll take away all this, and those go away. Faces. So, basis. Okay. Like so. And now we just place the wall tile, floor tiles there. And boom. We have a very, very messy, but acceptable, I would dare say, prison. Wait, are the... I think these are one too short. Yeah, these, this looks more like it. They, they want to be able to cram a lot of prisoners in here. I have no idea on if I'm building right anymore. I might be making huge mistakes right now. I probably am making huge freaking mistakes right now. But oh well. 
What can I say except you're welcome for the stories of Brattery Sea. Hey, it's okay, it's okay, you're welcome. Welcome you wanna be. Honestly, I could go on and on. I can explain every natural phenomenon. Okay, we want through one, two, three, four more. How long have we been going on? We have half an hour left before we uh, call it the day. I might quit earlier, but I I really want to try to reach that. Okay, like so. Okay, and then it's three on each side, which means, say with me, corner tiles. I have not set up anything for that, have I? Ninety, okay. And how about, I guess it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's eight across. Holy moly, I made this big. And like so, and across, and like so, and like so. That is one big room. Gosh. Still like so. No, like so. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and then we're actually going to, despite this actually being, you know, it actually uh, has a door, this place, we're actually going to close that up. Uh, we also want to add a hidden door. Have I screw myself over somewhere? Wall tile material. Okay, good. Um this here. So that is one, two, three. One, two, three, and then this wall. Eighty. God! <laughs> Okay, uh, 20 more minutes. Okay, so we want a three. Oh. And let's go into textured again, shall we? Um, wow, that's hard to see. Can I activate ambient light? Ambient oculation? Environment light? Generate lightning? No. Uh, let's add a. Sun, real quick. Okay, that's way too bright. Let's angle it a bit. Eh, that's good enough. It's it's that's satisfactory. Language. Words are hard. Words are hard, man. There we go. And then we want like this and ninety degrees. Uh, okay, so that goes like that. And that makes three. So let's go like so. And let's then take that there and like take that there. And two down. Before we reach a very odd room. Because this room is actually, you know, uh, a very sh strange shape. 
like triangular-ish. Okay, let's move some solid walls over here because I think we're going to need them. First of all, we're gonna need one here. And then we're gonna need one of these walls. 180. Roger! Let's place a solid wall here. Uh, oh, let's move that down there. Now this room holds a riddle uh, that I spent some time developing. It's not quite as intricate as I wish it was, but there are some high stakes if the players are reckless in this room. There's a riddle-esque aspect, uh, probably not executed as well as I could have, but eh, uh, I'll, I'll accept my work. Okay. There we have that. Okay, we're actually almost done with this. We have very few rooms left. We have a uh, bit up though this time. This time we're going up. Uh, which means we're going to take this path here. We're going to grab those. And move. And then we're gonna take them like one. One floor. One. Two. Two floors up. Ha 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 ha. One, two, three, four. Okay, four. Gates. Uh, because basically the thought, and uh, I think. You probably would want a explanation at this point as to what the hell I'm doing. Um, there's a huge snake statue uh, for the players to climb. And when they have climbed, climbed it, they can reach this place, which is significantly higher. Okay, let's take all of these, and let's actually build it like on the lower floor because it's laid out anyway, in a way so that that works. Uh, so I might as well. Now this is a circular room, but I don't have any like circular tiles or anything that makes me satisfied resembling it. So I'm just gonna use normal or standard tiles here. Uh, to build this room, same way we built down there, um, to make this circular room where we'll be needing a door. Just a standard door, again, for once. Uh, we'll move that there. Slow down, you're moving too fast. Got to learn to make the moment last, though. Feeling groovy. Feeling groovy. Sam and Garfog are freaking great singers, by the way. If anyone tells you otherwise, they have a different opinion. Uh, but in my opinion, they're probably like the best <laughs> duo I know of. One, two, three, four, five. It's probably our longest tunnel thus far. One, two, three, four, five, I think. But I might be wrong. 80. Um, now this place, this place is great. This is freaking great. I love this place. Um, this is going to be where the final really climatic battle 
of the dungeon is executed. Uh, because here they'll face an anathema. And hopefully it's going to be really epic, really grand. Uh, that or it just ends up real lame, but hey, a guy can hope. If nothing else, a guy can dream, right? Um, and we're actually almost done with this dungeon. Of course, we don't have, like, the system that this uh, huge freaking serpent is actually using to get around the place. But modeling that with tiles like this isn't gonna quite work because it's very organic in its structure because it's basically burrowed. Slow down, you're moving too fast. Got to learn to make the moment last. There we go. Okay, that is great. Now, how long have we been doing this now? We actually have like 15 minutes left, but I uh, I feel satisfied with this to be honest. This is great. Um. I do want to add like a little bit of work on this, a little bit of fine polish, which will be to get rid of these. Like so, and uh, let me just do like that. Slow down, you're moving too fast. Got to learn to make the moment last. Let's see her. Let's do it like so and like so. Yay! Now this. Now this, this is a dungeon. This is basically the layout uh, for the dungeon parts of that place. Um, so yeah, we got that. Let's play around a bit with um, materials. Um, okay, what should we do? Let's take the Where's the door material? Let's make them brown. Now we're just playing around. We're not, we're not necessarily going to keep this corner tiles. Let's make them darker. Let's make the floor tiles. Let's make them a bit like lightish gray. Uh, barriers. Looks like a darker. Uh, there, where's the wall tiles? Yeah, darker. And, um, solid wall tiles. Also a darker gray. And, uh, then we got the pool tiles. We're just gonna give a grayish hue. Uh, where's the hidden... Uh, I think this probably is it. Okay, I actually don't know what material that might be. So nothing else seems to be changing. Okay, we're just gonna ignore that one. Large statue. Let's give it a blue hue. Floor tile, we've already done. Let's go prison bars. Let's give that a light. There's some door.
Now look at that. Let's go into textured. That looks pretty darn good. I like this. So, uh, yeah. And do all that. Oh, it's just lagging behind. <laughs> Let's see here. I can't seemingly undo it all. Okay. Uh, we're just gonna shut down there. So, thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like, leave a comment, uh, tell me what you think. Give me any tips you got about you want to by the way. I really appreciate that. Uh, tell me if you want more stuff like this. I'll be designing more dungeons for this campaign, so maybe I'll do more of this. We'll see. Thank you all for watching, and until next time, I'm Vissi, and...